From its symbol is the is Fe, which is the Latin word for arum. And iron is literally everywhere. It's actually one of the most abundant elements in Earth, in Earth, on Earth, and in in in. And in. And in. Actually, yeah, primarily made of iron. Yeah, yeah it creates exactly. our magnetic field. There yes, we go. go. There you go. So, um, and partially that is because uh, why? Because it's super abundant in super massive stars and. Uh, Iron is actually the last element to be produced in a burst of energy as a supernova collapses. So when the star explodes, the iron is scattered everywhere. It's so cool. Now, surprisingly, as a metal, 100% pure iron is actually pretty soft. It's the impurities in iron that give it its strength. So when you combine iron with carbon, that's when you get steel. And steel is a thousand times harder than pure iron alone. Oh, so I guess that's why they call Iron Man Tony Stark the cool exec with the heart of steel, because it's the hardest thing about his body. Nope, I heard it. Sorry, my bad. Uh, Taryn, take it back. Okay, so iron mm -hmm. is actually in your body too, Woo! You superhero friend. <laughs> um, <laughs> in women, we actually have yes. about 3.5 grams of iron, um, and that's because it's dispersed throughout our, our bones and our muscles and our blood. Oh, all right, and iron is particularly important as a component of hemoglobin. Hemoglobin is the substance in red blood cells responsible for carrying the oxygen from your lung to the rest of your body. And if you don't have enough red blood cells, and then you get an iron deficiency called anemia, which makes it really interesting. Yeah, no fun at all. So, what's the way to prevent anemia? <laughs> ding, 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 ding! Eat, eat more eat. iron! Yeah. Great! So you're gonna eat foods like uh, red meat and poultry yeah. and fish yeah. and um, leafy vegetables, yeah. beans, legumes, watercress, chickpeas, mm. and yeah. blackstrap molasses. Whatever that is. No clue. Yeah, okay. Um, there are also many foods that are also fortified with iron, which means they're added in, like these cornflakes, which have nine milligrams per serving. We are now going to do an experiment with them to see if we can actually crush them up and extract the iron with a magnet. <gasps> experiment time! Experiment time! <laughs> Yeah. Bye. 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 Element a day in May.